Yes, with so many neighboring states now reporting serious trouble, we're keeping a close eye on the numbers here in Colorado. In El Paso County, there were 33 new positive cases continuing last week's upward trend. Pueblo County is reporting two, and in Teller County, there were no changes to report. But across the state, we know of 26 new deaths due to the virus, and 204 more Coloradans have contracted it. Now, those numbers are at risk of going even higher if people don't follow COVID-19 safety guidelines this holiday weekend. Weekend, but it comes at a time when fewer and fewer people seem to be wearing face coverings. News Channel 13's Julie Donovan talked to public health officials today who say this is not the time to let our collective guards down. It's been busy all day here at Garden of the Gods, and we're still five days away from the 4th of July, but I've seen maybe only half the people here wearing a mask. It's normally one of the most exciting weeks of the year here in Colorado. No, I think this is a great holiday and it's a great celebration for our country. But this year, COVID-19 is adding some concerns. I encourage people to celebrate, but do it smartly. And by smartly, he means people cannot let up on following the rules just because they're outside or they're with family and friends. But hopes aren't necessarily high that will happen. Evitt says there's worry some people won't wear a mask at all. There's uh, a lot of people who've decided that they're not going to wear a mask for whatever reason, and, th and that is concerning. While he says others just aren't taking COVID-19 seriously anymore. You no, know, I think there's a false sense of security that, that this pandemic is over somehow or it's not going to impact Colorado because our numbers have been uh, relatively minor. Public health officials want to remind everyone if you're celebrating outside, you still need to keep your social distance, and they're telling everyone not to celebrate inside. Reporting at Garner the Gods, I'm Julia Donovan, KRDO News Channel 13.